The Glitter Strip will be stripped of law enforcers as Queensland police try to combat a rising crime rate on the coast's north. A third of officers in Surfers Paradise could be sent to Coomera under the controversial proposal. When the sun goes down in Surfers, the party picks up. And so does the workload for our men and women in blue. But soon there could be fewer feet on the beat. The Queensland Police Service has confirmed 13 officers will move from surfers to Coomera on a three-month trial starting in April. But a leaked proposal suggests more than 40 could be redistributed by July, cutting the party precinct's numbers by a third. A frightening reality for bar owners. There's that air of safety that has now come to Service Paradise, which wasn't here a few years ago. But in two years, crime rates around Coomera have soared by more than 18%. Now politicians are fighting for extra police to cover both areas. We've got one police officer for every 2,300 residents in in the northern Gold Coast. Compare that to surface paradise. One police officer for every 300. The police are having a hard enough time, but without the numbers, it's almost going to be impossible. The service says there is no plan to permanently decrease the number of officers here in the party hub, and for major events, it will deploy extra specialist officers to ensure a consistent policing presence. Keeping surfers safe. On the Gold Coast, Mac Lyon, 7 News.